Okay, alright, I'm too tired right now to take this online, so I'm just gonna have to do this. So, update from the last video. Firstly, I get, I'm gonna do a Taker tutorial, uh, get that up when I can, when it is properly done. Secondly, I am definitely going to start looking into games to use for that Win Willie Quit shit. Definitely gonna look into that. If you have any advice for it, feel free to let me know. Like, if you want to see me play games, you can start... Oh, why the hell did I backdash? I got a terrible punish there. But yeah, if you have any games you want me to try out, like, feel free to suggest them. And I'll definitely look into them and see about... You know, and I do just to... Because a lot of you also mentioned, like, yo, hey, bro. You should totally check into PC gaming. Oh, God. Why did I try to do that? I did actually finally get a Steam account. Finally, after... Oops. And so I do finally have Steam. The reason for it was when I was actually first considering this, I actually went to Steam just to look at, you know, what they have available, various things, what their general prices are. And they happened to have that day, or I think it was that week anyway, and I just happened to get it on the last day. They had a sale on all Bethesda games. Wow, that didn't punch. And the one that interested me out of all those, like I'm not particularly, I enjoyed Fallout. I enjoyed Fallout 3. Fallout New Vegas wasn't really my jam, but that's not technically Bethesda anyway. That was Obsidian. I think it was Obsidian Entertainment that did that one. Anyway. Wasn't particularly big on Fallout New Vegas. Oh shit. Oh my god, that caught me. Um, Oblivion, Elder Scrolls 4, Oblivion wasn't really my jam either, if I'm being perfectly honest. Skyrim, I never even beat. Like, I never, I barely even played it. I probably played it for maybe five hours, just wasn't my thing. But they had the Elder Scrolls 3 Morrowind Game of the Year Edition available on sale for five bucks. For five bucks. Five dollars. I loved that game. Probably I think that was probably my second most played game in uh on the original Xbox, aside from Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. And I may have even beaten that out. Like Morrowind may be my most played, but I love that game, so I actually got it solely for that. So I do have a Steam account now. But I know, I know one game that I actually have heard a lot of good things about. What? Rogue Legacy actually just recently came out on the uh, PS4 too. I'm not sure if it came out on. Oh, why did I just try to sledge? That sucks. But it's more expensive on the PS4 than it is on Steam, but I'm definitely looking for- I'm, I want to try that out, because Rogue Legacy seems like a really cool game. So I'm just- you know, if you have any suggestions for ch cheap-ish games, like I don't want- if you think it's like a bad game, then I don't want to be, you know, buying a fucking $20 game that I'm gonna play for like 15 Nice sledge, Nate. Am I gonna lose the Talkaka here? Like, is that what's gonna go down? Because right now, this is not a good scenario. I almost did not catch her. <gasps> oh my god, that was Gadget Finger and it would have... Oh shit, son! Yo, I'm not liking the looks of this right now. Because I don't think this will kill her. Oh, this will kill her. Close. So, I mean, if it's like... If it's five dollars or less, I'll probably do it for sure. If it's ten dollars or less, I'll have to. I'll definitely have to do some consideration there. I'm not really sure if I would want to get a game that's not going to give me much entertainment. Like it would definitely be different. Nice, three sixty. Nate has per usual. I think I got Sledge there, too. Oh, 
Whoo, that scared me. I thought I would manage that timing correctly on the grand punish, and then I didn't. So I got I got a little apprehensive there. So anyway, what was after that? Oh, Under Night and Birth. I've actually, for those of you that are not aware, Arturo Sanchez posts a lot of the um, Team Stickbug tournaments that happen in New York. So if you don't know about that, check out the YouTube channel Team Spooky After Hours. Because they post a lot of Guilty Gear, a lot of Blaze Blue. I think he had an Arcana Heart tournament in the most recent one, but then Under Night and Birth was the biggest one. And I have to admit, like, I'm not particularly... Oh, God. I'm not particularly excited about the game. Like, I don't... I never even heard about it until you guys started asking me. But, um... The fact that that tournament actually got 64 entrants, that appeals to me. Like, if it can actually with have a lar a decent following where, like, the online's more lively than what Blaze Blues is now, because Blaze Blues is, admit I mean, Blaze Blues has kind of died. Like, just pure and simple. There's really just not that many people playing anymore. not gonna kill her I didn't even hit her I'm so good but that partially appeals to me what doesn't appeal to me though is like it seems like half the cast is probably like basically unkilled god that was terrible of me it's probably basically unkillable by the other half of the cast because like a bunch of them just have normals that are like reach three quarters screen or more just absurd range on some of these fighters as opposed to other ones which like look like they require you to basically be you know right you have to be right in their face huh? you wanna run that one by me again why didn't you jump forward ah now I'm fucked up now everything's fucked up now everything's all fucked up Clash. Because of the clash. Because of the fucking clash. I ain't rocking the Kaz ball right now because of that motherfucking clash! But yeah, that aspect of like, God, oh, why do I jump? Of that kind of absurd amount of. That kind of range, it makes it seem like neutral is just stupid. Like, just fucking hit buttons with these characters and they all confirm into full combos it's like it's like if Dalsum was fucking if he could confirm everything he does into a teleport combo like that is basically the equivalent in my mind I was gonna say, that's not even a hit, is it? Stupid. Maybe f I think 5C into that would probably be better. And it's kind of, and one of the characters that I would pick is one of those characters that has those kind of normals, that has. Because I would use Gordo. Like, I've. Every single time. Like, I would. If it's a Scythe user, I'm gonna use him. Same thing with Testament and Guilty Gear. If Testament was in XR, Testament would be my character. I don't care how good or how bad they are. I'm going to use those kinds of characters. I suck! And so I would use Gordo. And he definitely looks like... I mean, I have to assume just by the population. Fuck. Did my grab just clash with Magnetech Wheel? Like, that's what it looked like. Thanks for just standing there. And then the other character that I was most interested in, obviously I haven't seen everybody because I think only about half the cast was represented in that tournament. But the other character that interested me the most, same kind of deal. Merkava, or I think that's what it was. Like, fucking, basically the only like non-human looking dude in the cast. He looked like a fucking shark or something, I don't know. But that was the only other character that interested me at all. Oh, 
You motherfucker. How did he roll through that 2B? Or the 5B? I was so scared that was gonna be 360A. But 360A actually wouldn't work there. You have to activate. Well, no, it would've. Give me those two. Oh, shit. One of those two wall bounces, and I got him. And then I fucked everything up afterwards. So what are we gonna talk about? I'm talking about O'Neal. Yeah, I don't know. It's just the. It looks. It kind of looks like. It looks interesting, but it would probably be kind of frustrating to play just because. I mean, just from what I said, like. All the. You either. You're either playing a character that has these three quarter screen normals and confirmable high damage combos off of them, or you're not. So it basically splits the cast in half of like. This is the top tier competitive characters. These are the other characters. How did I press a button? I can't believe I didn't block that. That's ridiculous. I suck. And it certainly, I mean, like, just those thoughts alone certainly make it not worth it. Fuck, that was scary. Ugh. Like, I'm not gonna import it. I'm not gonna spend $60 on this game to import it when I don't even know if it's gonna be... Oh my god! Please recover. Fuck, I'm dead. That sucks. I've dropped... Like, every single death I've suffered has been due to a drop. Yeesh. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, we'll see. We'll see. I'm just definitely not in any way, shape, or form. Oh my god! I can't even do a 5C after that shit! Good lord! I was just sitting there that entire time, please don't whiff punch me, 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 damn, whiff punish it. Oh my god, that was spark! That was sparkle too. And sparkle finally came out, and I got blown up for using it. Fantastic! God damn! That entire round was just terrible execution on my part. Do we have anything else to talk about? Not really. Oh, let's fucking talk about how stupidly fucking terribly written. Obviously, I know not all of you are following my Persona 4 playthrough. Let's talk about how goddamn stupid it is. Oh shit. To run into parry, because that shit fucking hurts. Oh god damn it. Dude, this is just she is going wild on she is going wild on me right now. But yeah, these people that I'm looking at the guides for just to like cross check all this shit and stuff. Obviously I'm done with that now. Like I'm not gonna be checking any more guides. Just fucking I'm done. Oh my god! Yo, where was Oh, I thought I could. Damn it. I started trying to mash 720, but I didn't mash it fast enough. That was my fault. I'm pretty sure I could have actually 720. Please select your character. Um. So, what was I going to say? Azrael. Oh, right. So, I looked at all these guides and actually kind of like just reading through the information of them. It looks like they're all suggesting like you should play on easy mode. In that pit, like, you're playing is basically that everybody that reads this is is a bitch and like i don't want to say that's a, that's a poor term of it that's but like is not looking for a challenge like you you have these people that are going to be reading these guides because they want to be hyper completionists but most of those people also want a challenge in their game which means they're not going to pick easy mode but your schedule runs off the assumption that the person is going to pick easy mode like fucking really just that irked me when I when I found that out. 
looks ridiculous to me. Because they, they expect you to, uh, basically be. That was too late. But they expect you to beat Yukiko's castle, the first, the very first dungeon, in one night. In one night, this is it is the hardest dungeon for a variety of reasons. Firstly, just because you don't really have a large persona spread in the first place, so like you can't really cover all your weaknesses, you can't cover all your bases. Secondly, I'm gonna whip punish that shit. I'm not gonna whip punish that shit. You don't have a full party yet. You don't have a full party of four people. And so because of that, obviously, you're just, you're already at a disadvantage. Yo, is this bitch serious? Oh my god, she's serious. But you don't have a full party of four people, so you can't spread everything out. You can't really associate, like, this one person is going to be the healer. This one person is going to be the buffer. And then these other two people are, you know, going to be the offensive attackers or whatever. Thirdly, the first boss is a fire you. Oh my god, that came out hella late. I don't think I, I think it's because I didn't get the dash. Ah, I fucked it up. Fucked it up, and now everything's gonna go badly. Never mind. Fucking overheads. I can't block them. Too tired to react. I was mashing on grab. Bad idea, I guess. Mash on grab again, because I was thought for sure I would punish that. I thought for sure I would have 50 meter by then because I was wait I was sitting on 49 meter and it was still ticking up so I thought for sure I'd get to 50 and manage to rapid cancel the scud punish. Nope. The wheel of fate is turning. Rebel one. Action. <laughs> Oops, what am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing. Fucking everything up is what I'm goddamn well doing. <laughs> Let's use two six C's in the same fucking combo. That's smart, me. Damn. What the shit, dicks? He's gonna swing. I'm gonna run right into it. Oh, okay, good. I thought for sure he could relay. He would be able to release and just bot me in the face for some fucking reason. I fucked up. I fucked up. Oh come the fuck on, Asriel! Yeah, of course that's not gonna hit. Oh my god, what am I doing? Oh shit, is he gonna die? He didn't, yeah. Uh, oh fuck. I was gonna say he didn't. The dude didn't burst, so he's probably not gonna die. Cause that's what they do every single time. Like they know, basically, if you can finish them off with a distortion at that point, they burst immediately. That's just how they work. So yeah, I got a, I got a little scared. I got a little scared. I fucked up! I did the wrong motion! I actually timed it all correctly that time too. Which makes it even worse. Yeah, why am I trying to, like, compare dash moves with this character? I'm not gonna beat her with...
Oh shit, she done fucked me up right there. Oh, she didn't die. Should have done Hornet. Actually, why didn't I do Blackhawk Stinger? That would have been smarter. Oh, I fucked up again. Whoa. Why do I keep not getting the last dash then? Oh my god! Bro Cephasaurus, what are you <laughs> suck right now? Like real I love her. Nailed it. That was definitely a good trade. It was a good trade since it killed her, but in terms of if that actually happened and I didn't die, it just took like five times more damage. The wheel of fate is turning. Rebel one. Action. I'm I think I'm the best. I think I think I think I'm the best. Oh damn that none of that combo. Cool. Oh my god! Oh my god! Does this have same hit proration? Yes it does. But it didn't fucking matter! Oh there we go, now it matters. Son of a Fuck off, bitch. Oh shit. Oh shit. Uh oh. Uh oh. Use another one. Oh, okay, good. It didn't matter. I didn't know if she would die. Definitely had to be close. Son of a slot! Yeah, that's a good answer. Yeah. I am just the best. Literally. Like, if you look up the best in the, in the dictionary, I'm there. Yep. Proving it right now. Back. Back. Bitch, would you knock out with that shit? Oh, balls. So I think to say I'm doing amazingly right now would be an understatement. Yep, understatement of the century right now. To say I'm doing well. Doing excellently. My game plan is coming across clear as day. How the fuck? So, yeah, let's definitely... Oh, my God. I wanted to kill with a phalanx combo so badly, but I've just... I never used that move, so I... Like, it's so easy. You can cancel basically everything into phalanx cannon, but I just... I didn't do it. Because I'm a moron. The Wheel of Fate is turning. Rebel 1. Action. I'm stupid! Damn, I had a lot of... Ow!
<laughs> that was also scary, and then I've been counter hitting because of that I got 720, and now I'm fucked. Oh, I done fucked up. Oh, I pressed the button against Tiger and I fucked up. Oh, that's what I get for pressing a button against Tiger. Like seriously, you just you should not press buttons against Tiger in neutral. You just you just shouldn't. Terrible ass combo. I done fucked up again. I done screwed the pooch again. I'ma get something here. I'ma get like 368. Oh, I didn't. Oh shit. Oh god. No, I can't burst. Oh my god, that's the worst. <laughs> Tager's cheap. Tager is so cheap. I don't know anything about that video. I've, just, I've seen like... I, I don't... I, I, I wish I could quote it. Because I know a lot of people love that video, but I don't know. I only watched it like once ages ago. And I don't actually know how it goes. But I know it's that robotic voice. Tager is so Please cheap. Select your character. Since Tager is so cheap, we're gonna use him. God damn it, I can't believe I'm just so bad with Asriel now. I mean, I don't want to me. I, I don't think it's really that. I think it's just that I keep playing when I'm tired. And when I'm tired, obviously, you're gonna fuck up when you're tired. That's just how being tired fucking works. You're not at, you know, you're not at the pinnacle of attention. Your reactions are slower. Ow. You do stupid things like that. That also hit me. Son of a bitch. Too high? Too high. Why do I even bother? I'm tired and I'm hungry. Neither one off. But... Excellent. Fucking love that move. It's so useless. Like, legitimately, if you have any move whatsoever that can change your trajectory in the air, you're you're out of it. You're gone. You don't have to. If you can, you can press a button and mash out of it. You can double jump, and you're never gonna. He, he's never gonna hit you. Air dash backwards, and it'll fuck up the tracking. Yeah, unmagnetized. It's, it's so easy to fuck up that move. Son of a bitch. I, just, I don't know why I use it. Like, I keep using Tager's tools like how they should be made, not how they are. And that's a problem. That's my. That is my problem. I use tools that should be anti-airs as anti-airs, except they don't fucking work as anti-airs because they have they have no head invincibility. Their startup is too slow. I mean, there's there's, there's a laundry list of reasons on why that shit won't work. Oh damn, I blocked that correctly, and then like I reacted in time, and then he switched sides on me like the last second. Oh shit. Oh, you motherfucker! Oh, interesting. But yeah, that was supposed to be anti-air spark bolt, and then I would magnet tech wheel instead of a move that won't work. God, why can I just? Oh, 
execution is just not working out. If it, if it requires emotion, I can't do it right now. Why did I, I don't know why I tried to use it. So irritating. That's irritating to me. Oh my god! No, I tried it. I dropped it again. That was supposed to be a. Whoa! I can't do anything. I'm so incompetent. God. Seriously, like after that 2C, I was supposed to do a sledge, and it didn't just didn't come out. Yo, that was a sledge again. Can I do it now? Like, fuck, man. That is some horse shit. That's gonna be six. Yeah, definitely more than six K. That last hit. Oh my god, she just empty jump load me. Yo, shout out to that screen slowdown. Oh, I called it out right. She always jumps. It's just I did. I wasn't quick enough to grab. I should. That's what I should be doing ideally. Like instead of trying to tech trap people into 360C in the air, where like you know I think they're gonna tech and jump. I should just be doing air grab because I think I'm like 99% certain he'll get more damage out of air grab than any of his other anti-air options. God, I suck. Oh, shit. What am I doing? I couldn't decide if I wanted to do six beers. Oh, shit, she's still magnetized. What am I doing? I'm putting her in the corner. That was exactly... Exactly as intended, and then I fucked up exactly as intended in order to tech trap her into the spark bolt in order to kill her with Magnetech Wheel because the combo before certainly wouldn't have killed with Magnetech Wheel Terror Break. No way. Moron. Oh shit. Yep, that was definitely a mistake. Fuck off with that! Asshole game. Yes. Exactly what I wanted. I don't know why the fuck I just did that. Fuck. I tried to do, uh... Wait, no, did I rapid cancel? I don't even know. I don't even fucking know. I, I ended up with zero meters, so I must have rapid canceled somewhere. I fucked something up. I don't know. I'm too t This is how tired I am. I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing two seconds after I do it. I don't even know why I bother starting with 3C. Like, look, I got 3100. What am I doing? I got 3100 damage for that entire fucking combo. Like, how terrible is that? Mm. 
Oh, I done fucked up. I didn't think he was gonna roll past me, so I tried to do magnet second wheel backwards. And instead of doing magnet second wheel, crossed me up when he did it on the other side. That 360 really just beat mine, like really, bruh. You awesome. <laughs> Fucking unlimited tiger, I swear to god. SWEAR TO GOD! It didn't block fast enough. I swear to god, unlimited tiger, you son of a fucking whore. You son of a fuck. Whore! Man! Whatever. It's not like you have more health and like your 720 does more damage anyway. It's totally even. Why did I? That wasn't even 360. That wasn't even the invincibility. My meaty was just the least amount of meaty you could get. I got a steak that was completely bone. That's how. That is how unmeatified that attempted meaty was. Jesus. Shit, I didn't have I Fucker. I was waiting for that the entire time. Because I wasn't sure if the draw from regular 720 would be enough. So I just wanted to get that extra little bit from uh, Overdrive. I just, ever since I started playing Tails games again, I can never keep overdrive and overlimit safe. Uh, can you? I don't even. I don't even know. I don't even know what am I even saying. I don't fucking know. Fuck you. I'm sorry. What now? So this is going well. Greatly enjoy the current outlook of this. Right now, I think we're good. We're so not good. So, can we talk about how fucking great that combo was? Because that was just fucking great. Can we talk about how great that... You gotta be fucking kidding me! She cancelled out of a normal that wasn't she wasn't even recovered from yet. Oh my god, that's bullshit. I should have 720'd anyway. That was my fault for not 720. But still, that was bullshit. Oh my god, this bitch is rude. You're bugging me, Makoto. Your ability to do all of these things is bugging me. <laughs> oh, she's like she's flat. She's flat out murdering me. There's really no other. Oh my god! I'm just so bad. She's gonna die. She might not die. Oh my god! Why did I do that? <laughs> this is so much scarier when I'm dead. Like it's scarier after, like after the fact of everything goes down. But like while I'm actually doing this, it's not even scary because like I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. And put her in the corner. The plan was to keep her in the corner, but I didn't punish the roll, so go me. Always impressive. Always know what's about to go down. That's me.
I will never have. I will never have that combo down. I'll, I'll never be able to do it. Not 100% of the time. Like I, I could have. I would have sworn on my life, on the world's life in general, that that would have landed. All right. Maybe I just did the spark bolt late, but I thought that terror break was on point. And then the spark bolt missed. So I just, I know nothing. Fuck, did you not jump forward? Why aren't these beast legs ever landing? They're a shitty move. Nah, I can't even do spark bolt. Isn't that just so good? Yes. Precisely what you wanted. Oh my god! I'm just gonna go cry like I'm just gonna go cry. Like can I just quit now and go cry in a corner somewhere of how bad I am? Yeah. Yeah, it's actually better than going straight into Atomic Collider. That wasn't a counter hit? Really? <gasps> oh my god, that's terrible. This is just a terrible chain of events, isn't it? Finally, finally, that's what I was looking for the entire time. I really don't, like, other than situations like that where, like, they're forced to bounce mid uh, full screen. Because there is some diversity to, like, how far they bounce and how far they bounce back. And the, basically, the amount of time you have after Spark Bolt to do something. And so sometimes, you know, just the range doesn't work out to astral them, but that time it did, and I'm happy it did. <laughs> That's what I was looking for. That's why I wasn't Magnetech Wheeling. I wanted to do, what I actually wanted to get was a 5B, 5C Spark Bolt into, um, whatever it's called. I actually don't know what that astral is called. Is it just Gigantic Tager? King of Tager, right? That's what it is. Oh. I got him in the corner, Grant. I'm sorry. What now? So that was new. And it looked like while that was active, he just bounces out of every hit I get. Apparently. Great. Love that. Oh my god, he's like, that used to work 100% of the time. And now it never works. It never works anymore. Okay, let's see if I can actually get them. Thank you. Oh my god! I'm just, I'm not getting half the buttons. Not gonna hit. I should have confirmed it. And why wasn't that? That? That's what I was expecting, was that counter hit. What the- Dude! Oh, great. Oh, great. I'm dead. I might be dead. No, I'm not dead. I was so hopeful. I was so hopeful. Dude, that was... Why did that... Man, oh. 